the campaign ends, and you think that means the campaign ends, right? Who does? But if you, if you, if you, in our, in our age of the permanent campaign, it's not just all of the politicians. Some specifically we're going to look at here. Elizabeth Warren, remember, she's not running for president, right? She told us that repeatedly right. as she campaigned in 2014, yet she writes a big op-ed over the weekend uh, going after the Republicans, saying, watch them. They're in the back you know, pockets of the lobbyists. Watch their agenda. And then Scott Walker, the newly reelected governor of Wisconsin, he's also writing some advice for Republicans in Congress, uh, saying, you know, follow the governors here. Pass an agenda. Don't just oppose the president, pass an agenda. Um, are we supposed to read into that? Uh, you know, they, wasn't Wednesday the first day of 2016, the day after the midterm elections? I, I, there's a reason you see a lot of these people coming out, not only Elizabeth Warren and Scott Walker. Rand Paul has been around. Chris Christie was on every single Sunday show yeah. known <laughs> anywhere. Uh, Rick Perry's in New Hampshire? Yeah, <laughs> exactly, exactly. So, I mean, really, these guys are all, these, they're, they're ready. They're putting together their campaigns, both Publicly and privately, you see a lot of movement with Rand Paul and several of these guys. But, but in the case specifically, Jonathan, of Elizabeth Warren, when the, a lot of liberals mm. want her to run, she said repeatedly she was not, uh, when she stays in the middle of the mix, does that raise some suspicion or am I overreacting here? It definitely raises questions as to whether or not she still intends to stay on the sideline in 2016. But from talking to people around her, I, I can't find any possibility that, that she wants to actually do this. I, I think that she very much, John, wants to be in the conversation. I just don't think she actually wants to run for president. But how many times has someone been dragged into this where they really don't want to be? I think with Warren, I think part of it is, what if Hillary doesn't run? She's holding What's going to happen? Holding that space. Uh, she, she has that space, I think, if Hillary doesn't run. Yeah, look, huh. there, there is definitely an opening for her on the left. Right. Um, I just think at a personal level, it just mm -hmm. seems very unlikely. Right. Interesting, even if she's not running, she's clearly planting a flag here that she's going to be part of the Democratic agenda conversations going forward, even though she is a freshman yeah. senator, just like Ted Cruz is a freshman senator. It used to be the freshman senators were supposed to behave like freshman senators, uh, but not anymore, not in the new rules. You get it's to step up and speak. Isn't it?